Hi, and welcome to 3DMotive.com. My name is Stephen G. Wells. I'm a senior 3D modeler. In this volume, we're going to go ahead and continue our work on the Vampire Stake Launcher. In this case, we're going to go for poly painting the model. We're going to use a variety of different techniques for the hand painting. We're also going to be using Spotlight to sample certain colors so we can get a nice mix of some metal colors. We're then going to be using some of the same uh, techniques that we're using on earlier pieces on this as well. A lot of masking, blurring of masking, masking by cavity, masking by ambient occlusion. We're going to be doing a lot of sampling of colors. Uh, we'll then check each piece as we're working on it uh, with the BPR or the best preview ren render to actually see how the model is coming out. We'll continue from the, the back all the way through the front. We'll go ahead and get all the details painted in as much as we can get done. We'll then look to work on the uh, needle housing as we're moving forward. The last piece we'll end up working with uh, after the barrel will be the stakes and the holy water grenades. We're definitely going to use the, the spotlight for the wood texture. And then once we've done that, we're going to use the multi-map exporter in ZBrush to export all our maps. I'll take a quick look at them in Photoshop to make sure everything looks good as they should. And then we're going to take the model into Marmoset Toolbag to review our model and see what it looks like with our spec map and everything else in it. Anyway, thanks for watching 3dmotive.com, and let's get started.